Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, we're asked to evaluate the limit and justify each step by indicating the appropriate limit laws. So what we have to do is we have to turn this into a series of functions related to the limit as x approaches 3 of x, because this is just 3. Now, typically, we would just be comfortable plugging in 3 here, because there's no division by 0 that we have to potentially worry about, or taking the square root of a negative number, right? We just have a polynomial, so we would just plug it in directly. However, it's asking us to use the limit laws, so that's what we're going to do. And so what that means is that we take these individual terms and we take the limits of those. So this is equal to the limit, and it's always the limit as x approaches 3, so I'm not going to say it every time. So the limit of 5x cubed minus the limit of 3x squared plus the limit of x minus the limit of 6. Now, we have two types of terms here. We have these terms, which we still need to work on, and these terms we can just solve outright. So for these terms, the next step is to pull out the constant um, coefficient here. So the limit of 5x cubed is equal to 5 times the limit of x cubed. So we can similarly pull out the 3, so it's minus 3 times the limit of x squared. And just like we saw here, the, up here, the limit as x approaches 3 of x is just 3, so this is plus 3, and then the limit as x approaches 3 of 6, uh, no matter what x is equal to, 6 is still equal to 6, so this is minus 6. Next step is to take these exponents and say, okay, the limit of x cubed is equal to the limit of x cubed. The limit of x squared is equal to the limit of x squared. And then plus 3 minus 6 is minus 3. So this is equal to, um, well, the limit of x is just 3. So 5 times 3 cubed minus 3 times 3 squared minus 3. What is this equal to? Well, this is 5 times 3 cubed minus 3 times 3 squared is 3 cubed. So 5 times 3 cubed minus 3 cubed. I think of this as a 1. 5 of this minus 1 of this is equal to 4 of this. So this is 4 times 3 cubed minus 3. 3 cubed is 27. 27 times 4 is 108, minus 3 is 105. So the limit as x approaches 3 of 5x cubed minus 3x squared plus x minus 6 is equal to 105. And the limit laws that we're using are just, the, what this is referring to is the names of the limits in the book, right? So uh, they would call separating these, right, the subtraction law or the difference law, right, versus the sum law or the multiplication law, the exponent law. Um, so identifying the appropriate limit laws, what you just have to do is, if you use subtraction, right, difference law, or difference rule, right, and you go through, I think it's a little unnecessary, but I still used every step to get to the final answer of 105.